Hey guys, this is a recording of the evening prayers. Uh, again, my hope is that you'll be praying along with me to this recording and uh, put it on uh, before you go to bed each night and uh, look at it at the um, on your computer, or your phone, and uh, there's in the description below um, some of the prayers listed so you can read and follow along with me. Um, so I'm going to just, again, get the candles ready and um, pray together in a minute. Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And the prayers of our Holy Fathers, the Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Glory to thee, our God. Glory to thee. O heavenly King, O Comforter, Spirit of Truth, who art in all places and filling all things, treasury of good things, and giver of life, come and dwell in us. Cleanse us from every sin, and save our souls, O gracious Lord. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord, cleanse us from our sins. Master, pardon our iniquities. Holy God, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, now and forever, to ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, to ages of ages. Amen. In the prayers of our Holy Fathers, the Lord Jesus Christ our God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Come, let us worship God our King. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King and our God. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ Himself, our King and our God. Evening prayer number one. As we lay down for sleep, O Master, grant rest for our soul and body, and deliver us from the dark passions of the night. Subdue the assaults of our passions. Quench the fiery darts of the evil one which are set against us. Calm the urgings of our flesh, and put away all thoughts of worldly and material things as we lie down for sleep. Grant us, O God, a watchful heart, pure thoughts, a sober mind, and peaceful sleep, free from the temptation of the evil one. Raise us up at the hour of prayer, established in your commandments and holding stat fast within ourselves the remembrance of your statutes. Give us words of thanksgiving all through the night that we may praise, bless, and glorify your most honorable and magnificent name from the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, now and ever into ages of ages. Amen. So you can pause your recording at this time if you want to sing the Tropar for the Saint of the Day uh, or the scriptures of the day. I'm going to just sing for you 
uh, a typical evening hymn. We pray um, during Vespers. There's one already on light, and another is uh, Let Your Servant Depart in Peace, the Song of Simeon. So already on light, I usually sing uh, if it's earlier in the day, around kind of dinner time maybe, and the other uh, Song of Simeon, I sing just before bed, or I might just say it. Um, or Radiant Light, you might know your own version, so I'll just sing um, the prayer of St. Ephraim. Um, so it goes, um, Now let your servant depart in peace according to your word. For my eyes have seen your salvation which you have prepared before all people, a light of revelation for the Gentiles, and to be the glory of your people Israel. After I do an evening hymn, I'll do the prayer of St. Ephraim. Lord and Master of my life, take from me the spirit of laziness, despair, ambition, and idle talk. To get rather the spirit of humility, purity, patience, and love your servant. And so Lord and King, help me to see my own failings and not to judge my brother, for holy are you and sage as sage as on men. Lord have mercy on me. 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 O Lord and Master of my life, take from me the spirit of laziness, despair, ambition, and idle talk. Give rather a spirit of humility, purity, patience, and love to your servant. Yes, O Lord and King, help me to see my own failings and not to judge my brother. For holy are you as sages of ages on them. Just as a quick note on the uh, prayer of St. Ephraim, uh, you bow after each verse the first time, um, then you do a medanya with uh, Lord have mercy on me 12 times, and then the last time you pray the prayer all the way through, and bow at the end. So it's a little tricky. So you might practice that on your own if you can. Um, another note on evening prayers. Um, you can uh, uh, do your prayers kind of how the church thinks of a normal day. Um, it's actually sundown when the next day begins liturgically. So um, technically at Vespers uh, or around kind of dinner time is when the next day begins. Um, so you could do the saint of the day for the following uh, kind of morning during your evening prayers if you want to do it kind of liturgically. just thought I'd mention that for now, but uh, if you're like me, it's just easier to pray uh, a, a usual day as we think about it non-liturgically. And uh, you can... Um, pray the uh, hymn for the saint of the day during the evening or your um, patron saint or a hymn like I just did and again you don't have to do all these prayers these are just an example of um, some things to to practice and ways that kind of beautify prayer time and uh, I just wanted to share those with you so anyway uh, go get some sleep and uh, we'll catch you next time bye